Hello everyone, welcome back to our video series, Rare and Beautiful, for another awesome reptile to show you guys. Um, today, we have a group of snakes in the family of Pituophis, which include bull snakes, pine snakes, and gopher snakes. Um, all very similar, but different in their own way. This is an albino bull snake, which actually bull snakes are the largest of the three. Uh, reaching up to eight feet, very large snakes, and uh, <clears throat> this is not a large one, it's obviously a baby, um, and she's a female. We actually have four of these available, two females and two males. Uh, they're not related, but anyways, uh, it's a little albino one, so albinos, obviously the natural coloring's more tan, um, and uh, so this is very, very pretty. These are going to be really pretty when they, when they grow up. But bull snakes, um, <clears throat> they can rattle their tails and much resemble rattlesnakes in their appearance. I'll show you our gopher snake in a minute and you'll see a little bit more what the natural coloring looks like. Um, but yeah, they can rattle their tails uh, in the leaves and it sounds just like a rattlesnake and they can rear up. And, but with these guys, obviously being non-venomous, a lot of it is bluff. Um, they can strike and, and bite, but it's not harmful um, or deadly to humans. Uh, but, and a lot of it is bluff. Typically when you pick them up off the ground, even in the wild, they will be pretty docile snakes, as you can see. So this is a gopher snake, an adult male. So you can start to see what kind of size they can get. Um, and this particular one is from the Christmas mountains of Texas. Um, so they literally call these guys Christmas Mountain Gopher Snakes. Uh, just the locality. Um, there's some differences in appearance with uh, when you find them in different areas. So that's why different breeders will like to, to specify their localities. And uh, <laughs> here comes Jolly. <laughs> here comes Jolly. Hi buddy. Kind of interested in what's going on here. <laughs> <laughs> Just passing through. Anyway. Don't, don't mind him. Anyways, <laughs> um, so yeah, we uh, we love these guys. Uh, they have keeled scales, which uh, it's kind of a rougher feel. I know you guys can't feel it from there, but if you guys have us at any live events, you can feel these guys, the difference between these and, and like pythons or milk snakes from yesterday's uh, video. <clears throat> they have a lot, lot of a rough, more of a rougher feel uh, so gopher snakes get their name from invading gophers' burrows and uh, kind of taking them over or even hunting them to, for food. But um, that's where they get their name. But just very pretty snakes. They almost have um, two different patterns going on. The tail is just a totally different pattern than the, the rest of the body. So it's just a neat, neat, neat snake, neat colors. All right, so this is probably my favorite uh, species of pine snake and maybe of all the pituophis. Um, so this is the northern pine snake. Um, definitely a large male here. Just black and white, beautiful, beautiful snakes. Um, these guys, all three of these were from uh, North America. And uh, this guy has a, has a mate and she just laid five eggs for us. So we're pretty excited about that. Just a few days ago, we found those. So you can hear him huffing a little bit if you can. And that's another part of their defense. Uh, they're known to be really huffy and make a lot of noise, very dramatic. But again, a lot of it's just bluff. Um, kind of just natural reaction to, for you to leave them alone. Um, so actually these guys are very much ground dwellers. They can climb, but you can see he's trying to get back to the ground where he feels safe. So he's going down, but uh, Definitely awesome, heavy-bodied snakes. They are uh, constrictors as well. Very powerful snakes. Um, so yeah, it's the northern pine snake. Very, very awesome. And uh, yeah, so that is the reptile for today. Um, another beautiful creation here, showing you guys. And uh, thank you guys for joining us today. And we hope you guys stay tuned another video tomorrow we have several left and awesome reptiles to show you guys so 
have a blessed day.